let's check and change your video's aspect ratio. Now, if you're on your iPhone and Android, whatever you might have, and you took a video, but you might want it in a different aspect ratio or just to find out which aspect ratio it's currently in, I'll walk you through the entire process. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, let's head into the Photos app here, and I can just choose a random video. Now, you'll be able to see immediately there's two general orientations. One is a landscape video, and the other one is a portrait video. You can see because this one is wider than it is tall, it is landscape. If it is taller than it is wide, it is a portrait video. I can also tap on edit at the top right here and then tap on crop at the very bottom right. Now on here, the cool thing is aspect ratios and cropping to those aspect ratios is built into your phone. So at the very top right, you can see those various squares and rectangles. I can tap on it right under done. And now you can see I'm going to choose basically the orientation. So this one is a landscape orientation. So if I go over and I choose 16 by nine, if I had it basically in portrait orientation, it would look like that, but I'm gonna switch over to landscape. Now I'll be able to tell what the orientation or aspect ratio of this is because I can go back to original and then 16 by nine and it doesn't change it whatsoever. So the aspect ratio of this original video is 16 by nine, but I can also change it to five to four seven to five, three to two, I have a bunch of different options. And of course, I can also just crop it to a portrait crop. So you can see here, I can crop it nine by 16 or two to three, or I can go over and crop it to a square crop or for wallpaper. And this will essentially make it the exact same crop that you'll be able to use for the wallpaper on your iPhone if you wanted to add that specific video or photo as a wallpaper, you could do that as well. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks guys.